right. There's the workout there. And the workout up here. All right. Morning, everybody. Happy Thursday. Um, so today's workout, we've got killer armadilla. Um, it was a four-time workout. And we're going to be alternating movements. So it starts with dips. Um, if you happen to have a way to set up rings, awesome. If not, we can go you know, off the box or if you have stationary dips, any kind of dips you can do. Um, those are going to be descending. So 20, 15, 10, 5. Just remember, it's always going to be four sets of both movements. And then after each set of dips, we are doing dumbbell snatches, and those are going to be increasing in reps, right? So 20, 30, 40, 50. So dips will be decreasing, snatches will be increasing, right? Um, dumbbell snatches will be pulling from the ground and alternating uh, arms every rep. The equipment version today, instead of the dumbbell snatches, we're going to be doing power snatches, and the reps are going way down. So make sure you're doing power snatches, you uh, have those numbers down. Um, again, it's still increasing, and it's going to be 10, 12, 14, 16. All right, so a whole bunch of different numbers. Um, again, I'll have it up on the side so you can see the screen. If not, make sure you kind of write it down somewhere um, so you have it during the workout. All right, accessory today, we're going to have um, press ups and boot bridges. Let's talk movements and subs. So for um, the dips, right? Most people are all probably going off of a box. <clears throat> all right, so legs out are going to be uh, a little bit harder. If you need to, you can always bend the knees in. Uh, bend the knees or bring the feet in. It makes it a little bit easier. All right, we're trying to sit down into that as low as you can and press back up. All right, so full attention to the top every time. Always trying to get down as low as you can. All right. Um, sub today, we can go with just regular push ups. Right? So, good plank position. All right, same thing. Make sure we're getting all the way down the ground and fully extending the arms every single rep. And then we can also do um, shoulder taps. If you're going to do shoulder taps, it's going to be three to one, right? So, for every set, you're going to triple that for the shoulder taps. Right, you got a plank position, wide in the feet, and these should be controlled, right, to where you feel like you're not rocking side to side. All right, then we've got our dumbbell snatches. All right, so again, set up, feet should be roughly about squat width, dumbbell's gonna be between the feet. You're gonna drop the hips down, chest up, right, as you come up again, that arm is staying nice and straight. Pop the hips, jump under, and we stand. And uh, land in that locked out position and then stand it up. Right. Again, we'll alternate every rep. Right. Um, so some subs for that. If going to the ground bothers you, we can go from the hang, right, just above the knee. Same thing. We jump, landing in that lockout. Um, if any kind of hinging bothers you, right, then we can go push press. Right. So single arm push press. Um, Maybe alternate like every five reps. Um, if overhead bothers you, we can go power cleans. So from the ground up to the shoulder, right? We can do hang ones as well. Um, we can also do deadlifts. So if you can't really do much with your arms other than gripping, right? Same thing. You can do single arm. You can also do these with barbell. And we can do our staggered stance good morning. Leg out in front. You can alternate maybe every five reps, um, and then we can also do our glute bridges, right? Weight on the hips, feet flat, knees up, and we're pressing up, right? And um, you can pretty much do all the same subs with the barbell if you need to, right? Uh, again, since it's four time workout, we're gonna be finishing at different times. Accessory, we've got press ups, so just kind of a D low movement, right? Down the ground. Send the arms and chest, and then even we've got those uh, glute bridges. Same movement like the sub. All right, so it'd be 10 press ups, 20 glute bridges for three sets. 
for warm up. We're going to start with some inchworms. Okay. So again, legs as straight as you can. If you're a little bit tighter in the hamstrings, then just widen the stance. All right, a little more sumo. Okay. Keep those legs straight. We're going to reach down to the ground. Walk yourself out to a plank. Let's add in that push up today. And then we're going to walk the hands back and stand. All right, we're going to start with 10 inchworms. with the push-up today. Uh, try and loosen up those hammies. Get shoulders moving a little bit. And once you've done your 10, you can have a seat. And we're going 20 glute bridges. Right? So again, laying on your back, feet are flat on the ground, knees up. Driving up to the heels, squeeze the glutes at the top, nice and slow back down to the ground. Right, 20 glute bridges. Remember on those group bridges, not trying to arch up as high as you can, just to about neutral where you can open the hips, squeeze the glutes, keep your belly nice and tight. All right, again, once you've done your 20 glute bridges, let's flip back over. We're going to go into a plank position, widen those feet a little bit, and we're going to do 30 shoulder taps. All right, so 15 on each side, alternating, slow and controlled. So you're going to make sure as you pick your hand up, you can kind of feel yourself bracing and pushing into the ground and right? keep that good plank position. <clears throat> We're doing 30 shoulder taps. Next part we'll do together. So these are going to be uh, dip support holds, and we're going to be alternating every 10 seconds. Right? So however you're going to be doing uh, doing your dips, if it's off the uh, stationary bar or rings or box, um, we're going to start in the top support hold. That's so going to be arms locked out. All right, we'll be holding for 10 seconds. I'll tell you when to switch. Then the next 10 seconds, we'll be holding in that bottom position. Right, another 10 seconds, and then we're going to do that one more time through. 10 seconds at the top, 10 seconds at the bottom, right? So head to wherever you plan on doing your dips. Then we're gonna start in the top position, arms locked out. What's the hold. push up sub for that? Push up sub, you can hold top of a plank, 10 seconds, and then bottom, not on the ground, maybe just hover like a little bit. All right, we're gonna hold in three, two, one, and go. Top of the hold. Just 10 seconds. Keep the arms locked out. Three, two, one, lower to the bottom. Next 10 seconds. Three, two, one, back up top. Hold for 10. Two, one, back into the bottom. Five more seconds, three, two, one, and rest. Nice. 
All right, let's go ahead and grab that dumbbell. We're gonna go through a whole progression on one side before you switch, right? So this whole thing, you're gonna keep the dumbbell in one arm. If you've got a barbell, feel free to use your barbell. All right, so we're gonna start with deadlift. It's gonna be five single arm deadlifts. All right, tap the ground, stand nice and tall. Remember for this one, big hinge movement. We're gonna keep those hips a little bit higher. Squeeze your glutes as you stand. All right, so just five on the one side. Same arm, we're then gonna go into five high pulls. All right, shoulder down and back. Keep that dumbbell nice and close to you. Elbow comes up and back. And we're gonna do five strict press. Push up overhead. If your dumbbell's a little bit heavier for you to strict press, just add in the hips a little bit. Get a little push press. All right. Once you've done your presses, then we're going to go deadlift with a high pull, still on that same arm. Right. So from the ground, as you come up, we're just going to add that little bit of a pop. All right. Maybe for this one, go from the middle. Right. So add that little bit of pop to the top. Let that dumbbell move through the range of motion of a high pull. All right. Five of those. Then we're going to do five dumbbell snatches. Yeah, remember on the dumbbell snatches by the time our feet hit the ground, our arms should be fully extended and locked out. All right, so once you've done those five dumbbell snatches, let's repeat that on the other arm. So five deadlifts. And five high pulls. Tara, go a little wider with your hands on that bar. Yep. Five high pulls and five presses. And we're gonna do five deadlift high pulls. Right? Deadlift with a little pop. And then five dumbbell snatches. Cool. <clears throat> yeah, once you've done your snatches on that other side, let's go ahead, finish getting set up, especially those guys with the bars. Let's load that bar up, make sure you try a couple of those power snatches. Uh, if anyone needs to talk subs, modifications, beyond what we already went through, Feel free to uh, unmute yourself and ask. Hey, can you remind me with the bar, where am I starting from? The floor or? With the barbell? No, with the bar. For oh, the, the barbell, yes. The yeah, barbell. for the power snatches? Yeah. From the ground. Okay. Um, unless you don't have bumper plates, then just go like below the knee. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Can we talk about weight for a second? Sure. Like what would be scaled and uh typical or, RX for this would probably be a forty pound dumbbell uh, okay. for the guys. Um so scale would probably be around the twenty five ish, twenty five thirty. All right, got it. Thank you. Yep. Yeah, it's a lot of snatches. So you you want something that you can move pretty steady through. I have a thirty pound. I'm thinking about going downstairs and getting a twenty five. I'm not sure. Twenty five might be good. It's a lot, it's a lot of reps. <laughs> Is it the same reps with a barbell and a dumbbell? No, barbell is 10, 12, 14, 16. Oh, all right, I would have Yeah, seen. Yeah, that would be a heck of a lot <laughs> with the bar. <laughs> 10, 12, 14, 16, all right, thank you. Yeah, remember it's four sets, guys, so if you have more than four numbers per movement, You've done something wrong. <laughs> hey, Alan, one yeah. more question. I'm sorry. If I, if I okay. switch back to dumbbells. If you wait. switch back to dumbbells, then your reps just increase. Right. Lot. I'm sorry. I'm hearing someone's music. Oh. Yeah. But, uh, is it, do you switch every 
snatch. Yes. And for women, the weight? Uh, RX would typically probably be like 30, SX okay. like 20. Okay, thanks. Any other? Alan, 25 yeah. pound dumbbell? 25 pound dumbbell or 44 pound kettle? Um, because it's you, I think you'd be okay doing the 44. Um, but there's nothing wrong with doing 25. <laughs> so, you know, if you're feeling beat, or you know, that's a lot on your shoulders, or even, yeah, you know, I mean, it's definitely a harder transition with the kettlebell. Use the 25. It's a lot of reps, anyway, you spin it. Yeah, and getting a lot of use out of that ladder. I like it. <laughs> Let's go last name. He's got two ants. Got Napolitano and Crincoli. Um let's see. My power snatch people with the barbell. Anyone still need a minute or two? It looks about ready to go. This guys are good. Give me a thumbs up. Let's see if I'm waiting on anyone. Cool. I think we are about good. So I know you guys might not be able to see this, but here's the rep scheme. On the side. Blue is if you're using a barbell. Okie doke. Let's get started. So starts with dips. Your first set's gonna be 20 dips and then 20 on the dumbbell, 10 on the barbell. All right, we are going in 10. 20 dips to start. Remember, try and get slow as you can. Lock the arms at the top. Two, one, and go. Remember, adjust that movement as you need to. Start to get really hard to lock those arms out. Start to bring those feet in, bend the knees a little bit, or rest. Those of you guys on the rings, make sure we're keeping those rings right against your body and trying to keep them parallel to each other as best you can. Nice, Tina. Job, Lisa. Thanks, Joe. Nice, Toby. Tommy. Nice, Maria. Our first set of barbells, 10. First set of dumbbells is 20. And in dumbbells, we are alternating every rep. Nice, Tara. Cole wants to go heavier. Nice. <laughs> <clears throat> nice, Tina. Good push presses. Awesome. Job, Gordon. If you can try and get that from the hip straight overhead without that kind of like halfway pause on the shoulder on the way up. All right, big hip drive up. There you go. Just be a little more aggressive on that punch. Nice. Right, again, as you go through working into that second set, remember the dips are decreasing in reps and the snatches will be increasing in reps. 
job, Mark. Nice, Michael. Nice job, Sarah. Around those snatch movements, it's mostly hips. Pop it up. And then get under it. Nice, Sam. Sounds cool. Good job, man. Come on, buddy. Keep it going. Nice. Nice work, Lisa. Good, Martina. Nice punch up. <clears throat> Tell me the Della Sant. Nice, Vicky. Nice, Joe. There you go. Try and drop those hips a little bit when you're going down. Yep. Nice. Nice job, Tara. Nice, Michael. Good Maria. Come on, Toby, shake it out back on those rings. Nice, Sam. There you go, Nicole. Nice. <clears throat> Good job, Tina. Come on. <laughs> it's a lot of arms. Well, for you, it's all arms. <laughs> Good job, Sarah. Great work, guys. Keep it going, keep it going. I think most people are on that third set. Good, chip away. Nice, Tara. Good snatches. Wait, hang on that bar. Nice, Ant. There you go. Keep that up. Come on. John Maria. Nice, Mark. Shall we, sir? <clears throat> Job, Sam. Come on, buddy. Keep it up. Stay by that bell. Come on, Maria. Let's go, Michael. Big hips. Come on. Nice, Joe. Big punch up. There it is. Nice. Good, Vicky.
Nice call. Come on, Maria, stay on it. Nice work, Tina. Job, Gordon. There you go. Nice, Lisa. You got it, Anne. Come on, step up. Yeah, Maria. Keep those elbows up. Push them up. Get under. There you go. Nice. Nice, Toby. Job, Nicole. Way to get under it. Nice, Vicky. Job, Martina. There you go. Can I dip under that a little bit more, Joe. Nice big push, Martina. Awesome. Job, Lisa. <clears throat> nice work, Sarah. One big heave up. Nice, Nicole. Wait, hang on a minute. Come on. What's up, Ant? Nice, Sam. Great work, guys. Come on. Work through those snatches. So Michael. Nice job, Sam. Awesome. There it is. Come on, Nicole. Go, Mark. Nice, Vicky. Good lockout. Job, Lisa. Nice, Martina. And those guys that are done, accessory is three sets, it's 10 press ups. There's definitely a lot of hinging in today's workout, so press ups will help deload you a little bit. And then um, 20 glute bridges. Hi, nice, Sam. Job, Ant. <laughs> Don't hit the garage opener. Nice, Joe. There you go, Gordon. You got it, Martina. Come on. Keep moving, guys. Keep moving. Thanks, y'all. Later, Aunt. Ciao, Lisa. Oop. What happened to my screen? Darn Google. Thank you. Thanks, Alan. Bye, Maria. Bye. Welcome. Bye, Maria. Bye, Martina. Bye, Alan. Thanks, guys. Oh. Nice work, Lisa. Nice, Joe.
Down, Michael. Nice ant. Let's go, Mark. There you go. Hang on to that bar. Nice. Thanks, Alan. Nice job, Vicky. Hi, thank you, Alan. <laughs> Bye, Lisa. Good job, man. Was that a 70? That, look, that dumbbell looked bigger than usual. <laughs> yeah, it, it feels heavier than usual, too, I tell you that much. <laughs> that was a lot of reps with the barbell, or the dumbbell, I mean. Yeah, it's a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. Nice, Joe. Job, Mark. Nicole, what did you end up using on the power snatches? I had to drop the weight. Oh, you went down on the weight. I started at 80 and then I went to 75. You could have done 80. I can, you know what it is, is I can't drop the barbell in here and um, uh. <laughs> I, I don't know, I couldn't. If I, I, I just like get in my head, I'm gonna be like the last one and then I like. That's I fine, know. yeah. No, that's when in doubt, you'll go lighter and go faster. There's nothing wrong with that. I'm mad at myself. It didn't. It felt very, very heavy. Well, plus you're doing dips. You always hate doing dips. <laughs> Good job, Joe. Nice, right. Mark. Nicole, Nicole, you got to get like a gymnastics mat. I can drop it on this. It's not too bad. Look at that. That's awesome. Yeah. Awesome. It's the only thing. Otherwise, I got to guide it all the way back down. So. Yeah, I can't uh, drop my bar when I do it at home because I. I always work out when the kids are sleeping, so if I yeah, drop, the kids wake up. Good. Yeah. It hurts my neck constantly, like. Yeah, to to bend. It's like, yeah. You know. That's good. Then you work on bar path, right? So as you lower, it's here, as opposed to that kind of like kettlebell yeah. swoop down. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you, Toby. What did yeah. you do, Eric? No, I I don't have one fifteen. I can't do it. So I, I did ninety five. Okay, so now I don't feel so bad. <laughs> good job, guys. Hey, Joe. Yeah, good job, Mark. Good to see you, buddy. Good to see you, too, Joe. Thank you, guys. Thanks, Alan. Bye, everybody. Thanks, Alan. Awesome job, guys. Thank Thanks, you. Mark. Is, job, this the, is this the movement where your feet hurt for some strange reason? Uh, the dumbbell, uh, the, the kettlebell snatches? Snatch? Yeah. Ten. Yeah, totally. It's, a, right, it's a lot of reps. <laughs> <laughs> nice work. Have a good one.